solution. I think one thing we ought to think about um, as, as a campaign is what the events of the last week, uh, the effects they will have. Because there's no doubt that the, the CIA and national intelligent intervention um, has somewhat pulled the rug from under Bush's plans to attack Iran. Um, and, you know, obviously the, you know, the, the campaign of destabilization and sanctions will go on, but whether, you know, it's, it's less likely now that there will be an attack um, by the United States on Iran. Doesn't mean that they won't give the green light to Israel to do some limited attack on, on, on Iran in the next period. But I think that actually means something for the emphasis, perhaps, of, of, of campaigning on the issue. Um, I.e., it might mean that in the current period we need to put more emphasis on the question of building links with struggles in Iran, with trade unionists in Iran, with the democratic movement in Iran um, o over the next period, rather than being faced with um, having to organise uh, an immediate campaign around, around a threatened uh, attack. And I just think we ought to think about that because something has changed following that intervention from the, uh, um, the National Intelligence Services in the United States. Because it was a shot across the bow um, of, of the Bush uh, wing in, in, in the White House. And in some senses shows how weak uh, Bush is at the moment in terms of, of uh, his position in the, uh, um, in the, in the executive.